Hi guys and welcome to Super Met. Today I am in Kent countryside near Orpington and I am at a car event um, at a uh, car storage company. Um, they put on a kind of a cars and coffee on a Saturday morning and a lot of people have turned out. Have a look at a few of these cars. So we're going to start over here. So you can see a uh, little Mini Cooper, John Works, I think, over there. TR6, the Morgans are out, nice number plates. Um, the Audi that you may already know, uh, my car. The 928 S4, RX7, rather nice Spider, 430 Ferrari. And there's a nice Targa over on the other side. And then we've got uh, another Ferrari 430 over here. And then we've got the Aston boys over on the other side. And then on the inside, we've got lots more cars. So there's some real little gems and jewels in here. So let's have a little look around. You can see a TR6 over on the corner. Pretty car, Jaguar, it's beautiful. That's a replica. Um, a Plexi Ferrari Dino over here. Um, Jaguar E-Type fixed head. Um, and then we've got a more modern uh, AMG Mercedes. Um, just in front here even a London bus one of the original London bus uh, I think they're called the travel master okay so I'm sorry about the audio it's a bit noisy in here lots of music going in lots of different places so you can see uh, beautiful concourse Ferrari 412 this one is going to be featured on the channel shortly so this is the Stingray Nissan 964 Porsche convertible. This is a Citroen. Beautiful old car. Lovely condition. And then we've got a uh, fixed head stand. Beautiful BSA motorcycle. E type. Concourse car. Convertible. Let's have a little look inside this one. And it's left hand drive. Okay, uh, under here, I'm not quite sure, it's a BMW I believe. This is lovely, this is going to feature on the channel shortly. So this is a 912 Porsche. Um, pretty much concourse, been uh, rebuilt um, and a uh, lovely car, owned by somebody locally. This is owned by a gentleman overseas and um, Porsche uh, 4 litre RS. Um, the car has delivery miles and um, he bought two cars and this is his second car. His other one he drives on a daily basis um, in Tokyo, and this is his car that he actually retains and keeps here. Um, so you can see, absolutely perfect in every way. Even got the fire extinguisher down on the floor, but it is a delivery mileage car. This Nissan is owned by the man that owns the Stingray, same guy. Um, very, very rare. This has got a race prep engine inside it.
did one more than I turned out. The Ventador. Huge brakes. Great to send it across to you. No, no, no. Okay, take a look at this. Proper engine, the V12. Build number, look at this strut bracing. Beautiful, really nice. So much carbon work on this car, so it's got a lot of optional extras. Okay, so if we go inside, it's got this wonderful smell in here. Smell of cowhide. So you've got the carbon binnacle over here, carbon following through on the centre console. Um, this car has got the optional two uh, double stitched interior. It's got the logos up on the seats in contrasting green to match with the, uh, the green stitching and then the, uh, the leather interior. Illuminated door sills. These very wide door sills because you've got the carbon tub of the car comes through then with the double stitch lines. And these are uh, beautiful scissor action doors. The trait of the Aventador. And these huge wheels. Look at those for brakes. Beautiful. Very, very nicely spec car. Carbon work again on the outside. It's been PPF wrapped. Reception. This carbon work here is stunning. Seriously hot today. 